What up G's? This is for my masculines on this beautiful day of Sunday. What do y'all need to know? Let's go. Alright, at the root chakra, my friends, homies, you guys, you guys, you guys, <laughs> what's up with that? What is that, the Goonies? Yeah, you guys, <laughs> baby roof. Of that movie all right 25 what do you guys need to know about the root chakra all right at your roots this is your feet your knees your legs and your genitalia genitalia bro um y'all might have a super ego y'all gotta check it and this super ego is a hack this is a way out this is a way to con contemplate of shrinking, of being a psychopath. <laughs> Yo, chill. Check it. Just listen. Um, maybe somebody is blaming me, like blaming you. This energy is, I'm actually so scared. I'm so scared of the mystery, of mystery, of my story. I'm scared of my story. What's up, guys? What's going on? There's a dark energy around. If there's a dark energy around, you're going to feel some heartburn check it nope note to self this is also a countdown are you experiencing some joint pain are you not trusting your gut on some of these fellowships that you've been uh around mm, maybe with their i love yous or i heard fake i love yous black and yellow black and yellow y'all might be steelers fans it's that pra prara magnetic I forget. I gotta talk to y'all logical. <laughs> I can't come in with the with the feelers because y'all are gonna be like, what? What she say? Okay. Here's the here's the dealio. You're supposed to lead, bro. Be constant in your leading. You want a good feminine at your side, by your side, with you, then you need to be perceiving when there is a psychopath. What is a psychopath? This could be, for you guys, this could be some type of girls that charm us through lies. Mm, cuidado. She might have that glamour magic on. That lipstick, that eyes, that fan. And I just heard that, that weird ass joke. Girl, you so fine. You must be fine wine. I don't think that's how it goes. It's just shit like that. Count own. Count own. They're coming for your account. Because you've got a brass ring. Something you're really good at. You're really good at... You've got a Midas touch, bro. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. You've got Allah. Allah's on your back. Allah's on your side. Of that fellowship. Fellowship. I keep hearing fellowship of the ring. Some type of ring. And I hear ring around the roses, can tan tan roses. Oh, you might be attracted to the cuckoo crazy, that mysterious woman. Yeah, you like that cuckoo crazy girl, but there's a difference between a mystic and a witch. There's a big difference. Because we come from the Lord God and they're on the other side of the tracks. And it depends how you say it. I know because there's the good witch. There's the white witch. There's, you know what I mean? The ones that are helping, healing. And there's other ones that are not. The helping and the healing is going to look like math and music. She's into numbers and she's into music. The other ones... Just letting you know. We talk about numbers here, bro. <laughs> what do we have? Four minutes. 430 okay so that's at your root chakra at your sacral we need to know 13 and 12 ah 13 ah you too also have a control issue but your control is 12 your sh your tactic is at 12 let's see what's the 12 this is how you shift gears 12 how do you shift 
You're shifting from mean girl to mean girl? The fuck? You're shifting from hidden hater to mean girl to a stranger to, mm, I want him to a girl that you want to have to want you. Ay, ay, ay. And why do I hear this shit of, I need to feel needed? Like, dude, no, no. Homegirl's gotta have her own independent life. You've gotta have your own independent life. And you don't need a girl who is ditzy and who doesn't know what to do. Like, the fact of, I don't know where to, how to pay this bill. I don't know how to do that. I don't, like, what the fuck? No. Trust me. You're gonna, you're gonna end up in a, in a whirlwind of BS, right? Because sugar baby, will you be my sugar daddy? Ah, pendejo. Pendejo. <laughs> no. I'm gonna talk to y'all like if you're my brother, so get with the program. But this is a punk bitch. You, you, you shift on punk bitch energy, on dullness, on disloyalty of the same thing. Eh, 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 eh. If you don't do that self healing, you're always gonna be in this fucking fairy tale, chasing tails. <laughs> and I hear duck tails. Do 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 do. No, no, no. And you know why? Because of this energy right here, right here. I got you. I got you. Hate with me. I need you to hate with me. I need you to have a connection with me. I need you to have a closed loop with me. I need you to be on rent and repeat of that Groundhog Day, doing it over and over and over and over and over and over and over of that habit loop. <laughs> right? Because we, damn, we have self healing and then we have healing apart. This is what's messing with your aha moments. Of, because you're not doing that self-love, dude. You're all about that fan fiction. Oh my god. What the fuck? You're drowning, bro. You're drowning. <laughs> Look. We can see you have massive potentials. And we can see that you can be soft and sharp. However, there's something in the past that's messing with you. You, you have like this disorder. And if you're having like this disorder, remember that I'm not a, I'm not a doctor, I'm not a therapist, but if I'm seeing the energy that I'm going to tell you, go get checked, go check yourself, right? If you experience a pulled back muscle, if you're experiencing some elbow pain, it might be because you've been around people who are mean to you, mean girls, a hidden hater. You've been around people who is a sugar baby who are using you. You've been around people who don't let you lead. Look, we have Peter Pan. And the Lost Boys. How's that Lost Boys song go? That one's a really good one. Hi, I'm Peter Pan. Ah, oh, dude, I don't know how it goes, but that one's a really good one. Look, and we got Capricorn. Ooh, maybe you're messing, with, messing around with the Capricorn. Maybe this mean girl is a Capricorn. Could be your mom, your sister, your aunt. Someone close to you. Someone close to you. I am a lost boy from Peter Pan. I don't know how it goes. Why help? Why am I going to help these people if they're not going to help me? Uh, that's that, that. There's that switch, yo, of being close-fisted. Y'all need to lighten up. Lighten up. Take advantage of realizing who is actually hurting your self-image. They're creating a damaged self-image. This is the Matrix code. You saw the Matrix, right? And so I want you to totality. I want you to think about, do I deserve this? I deserve this? Because what it actually says is, I deserve this. So maybe deep down you feel like, I deserve this because of what I've done and how I did it. This all comes back to the law of rhythm. Look it up. It's in Hermetics. Maybe you need to eat some hard-boiled eggs. Hmm? Maybe some sweet peas. There's not a lot of healing on here. This is comes from your light of your will. And that's that solar plexus. That's that solar plexus energy. Let's see. 
Let's take it to the third eye, and the third eye is 70. Oh, bro. I can already tell you that's a hard, that's a hard energy. Because you got a zero. If there's a zero in it, God's like coming down on you like... <clears throat> no, niño, no. Niño, como andas? Andas mal, andas mal. Okay, let's see how bad you are. Let's see, what's going on? Ooh, demons. Oh, are you around demons? If you're around demons, this is probably why you have stagnant energy. Maybe you're constantly chasing these people. And, and look, we have immoral woman. What did I tell you? Th this is a Jezebel. Oof. Maybe people called you a real dick and you're just kind of going along with it. Like, yeah, yeah, I am. Like, dude. This is somebody who might have blackmailed you. Or was trying to blackmail you. Mm -hmm. And, the, and the, it all comes down to this is your duty, they tell you. This is your duty and you need to do this. I like, what the fuck? You know why it is? Love is my drug. So you might be struggling through some sex, addic sex addic addictions or self-esteem uh, self -esteem issues. Maybe you never felt good enough. Yeah, because people belittled you. Blackmail again. Maybe you're all obsessed with this trophy wife. Damn, image image is happening again 70 is the shadow why the so why the shadow okay because maybe deep down you thought to yourself am i the bad guy do you think you're the bad guy or is it all just fucking jokes to you uh, get it together it says get it together okay well how do we get it together we have to look beyond the veil of looking beyond the bill is you need to figure out what makes you feel better who makes you feel better which teacher is going to make you feel better maybe you're dealing with some type of swelling maybe you need to pray more and this is facts pray but i'm talking about pray like for real like when you pray to god you ask god god help me be a better man no <laughs> that's what they tell you to do no and i want you to be for real god i don't know what to do with this bitch this bitch is fucking with my head i know she's doing this she's doing that i don't know what to do and god's gonna be like what's it gonna be it's either a or b there is no a b this ain't no fucking geometry this ain't no fucking algebra <laughs> maybe you got caught up in something of somebody brainwashing you. Oh, yeah, the shadow. Look, we got Sagittarius here. Oh, maybe this is a Sagittarius that fucked with your head. Some time ago. Why did I say it like that? Some time ago. It sounded like a song, but then like also it sounded like the beginning of a movie. There was a pinky promise that you did. With somebody who was unclean. This viper bitch. Very erotic. Maybe you slept with a demon. Because I'm looking at henchmen. This person was a henchman. And maybe she cur 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 curled your toes. And you've never been able to experience that again. However, comma. This dissected your aurora. Allah. <laughs> it was hard to talk. Like. <laughs> like how do you know that? That's what came through. This energy that you slept with this demon, this henchman, that curled your toes, left you with swollen glands, deaf ears, and a dissected aorta. Why can't I say that? I want to say aurora. Aorta. There it is. Hmm. Hmm. There's something bloody about her. Bloody, bloody zombie. This person learned to speak. She probably taught you how to speak ill will. Her name might be Ashley. Hmm. Hmm. What the fuck? How do we heal that? We gotta look to seven. If we're at 70, we gotta look to zero seven. Okay, how do we how do we get out of this? You gotta find a spirit sister, a real sister of the spirit. Hi, I'm her. 
<laughs> okay. Um, how do we heal this energy from this demon? Chicken blood. Oh yeah, she did a spell on you, bro. With, and then called you a piece of shit. Or maybe she did it with shit. Chicken blood and some eye drops? Allah. Maybe fed it to you in a lobster dinner? Oh my god, what the fuck is happening right now? <laughs> shit. Some cuckoo crazy shit. You want to talk about the mystery? We're talking about it now, bitch. They're saying burn some bay leaves. Okay, burn some bay leaves. The reason why you probably found yourself with this fucking demon who was probably at La Zona. Maybe this was like that one night stand that you had sex or maybe you had sex with a minor and maybe you didn't know she was a minor and then you were just kind of always stalking minors but not really doing it. But then this is probably why you called yourself a piece of shit in your mind and you're starting to think maybe this happened since birth. No, this is what she implanted, implemented in you, this time jump into your garage which is close to your heart hmm? when you're talking about the temple it's always formatted in the format of a house so like the kitchen is your heart the garage is like the garage and if you go into the garage and there's a door that's locked that means they they've they've closed your ashak records from here on out mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this person was a covert narc covert narcissism this person was heartless Right? Here it is, the mystery of you. You don't want to know the mystery of them. We need to know the mystery of you, homeboy. We're fucking tired of hearing about these bitches. We want to know about you, bro. What is it about your corazón that we like so much? Eh? That open palm, those kind eyes. What is it about you? There's no self-awareness there. Oh, that's the totality. There's no self-awareness. Why? Why no self-awareness? Because you're resisting it. Resist. You're on the menu. No, you are misguided. You are misguided. And instead of you, instead of you asking for help, right? To ask for help, you keep yourself in prison. And then look, we have rhythm. So really, really, really look into the law of rhythm in hermetics, the hermetic principles because we have rhythm here again and the rhythm is to know time and space that's the polarity that you need to really understand maybe go swimming is another way to heal of this necromancy of bewitching you of migration oh my god you guys are in deep with some poison hmm if you're experiencing some restless legs Yep. If you got some twitching on the bottom of your right eyelid. Yep. Hmm. Balance is the key. Balance is the key. Maybe go eat a French roll. Talk to a spirit sister. She could be black or white. Um, get yourself some howlite. Some green adventuring. Put them in both pockets, white, green. And y'all need to talk, pray more to Christ the Redeemer. Seriously, pray. Pray, pray, pray. The next time you're having this addiction come up, pray. The next time you want to do some, find, uh, find some more booty calls, pray. Don't fall victim to that shit because you're finding demons, yo. Who are going to constantly be misleading you. Yep. Yeah, the ring of fire. Oh my goodness. Ooh, and this is affecting your knowing. Your knowing, your third eye. This is affecting your knowing. Wow. And it's leaving you into that fear action of stalking. Because at the bottom of it all is, I should have protected her. Maybe there's someone here that you feel guilty that you didn't do you didn't do something for her or been there for her I, i'm seeing mother sister cousin someone that you really care about 
someone that really matters to you. Like whatever, whatever happened, happened. Let it be water under the bridge. It's over. It's done. Don't hold your, don't hold yourself in contentment so long, so much. Okay. It's done. It's done. She's fine and perfect and beautiful and wonderful now. And whatever happened to her, she's a grown ass adult. She knows what she's doing. And if she's not, then once again, we, we got to learn how to ask for help. Okay, guys, for real. I know sometimes it's a little hard for you guys because there's an emotional manipulator and then you're just kind of like a sinkhole. Uh, maybe this happened in February. Nah, we're going to leave it there. That's too much information. <laughs> we're going to leave it there. So I'm going to take it to my deck for you guys. I want you guys to know how amazing you are. And so I'm going to drop it a little bit. Drop, drop, drop the bass. Do, 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 do. Drop, drop, drop that bass. Oh, oh. All right. What do my guys need to know, Divine Masculines? I need, you to, I need you to know the gifts that you have. What gifts do the Divine Masculines need to know for this Sunday? All right. A la chingada. I see you, mas. Hey, what you already know that has come out of the book is 888. I am abundant. You have a lot of. As you focus on your wonderful things that surround you, you are clearing the path for more positive energy to flow into your areas. Uh, areas. It's not just sex. Because I literally saw the why <laughs> in my mind's eye. Flow into all areas of your life and creating a place for abundance. Maybe get back to like basketball. Maybe get back to, we were talking, we were singing bass. Maybe get back to using your hands and creating bass. Maybe you're a DJ. Maybe you want to make some music, making beats or something. Do that. Use that creative energy instead of always wanting sex. Use the energy for creativity instead of always wanting to do the do. You know, number two, and this is what you don't know because they all fell upon the book. And, and if, if she closed a door in your subconscious mind, in your dreams, in your dreams is depending which room in the house you're in. I'm going to repeat that in your dreams, whatever room you're in is the part of your subconscious. Now these fell upon the book. You have one, two, three, four, five gifts you are not aware of. Number 24, I am generous. I am generous. That fell in the upright. Number 333, three, three, I am powerful. That fell in the upright. This is, you You won't even believe it. Number 9 in the reverse, I am compassionate. She don't want you to know that you are very compassionate. Number 21, I am inspiring. Yeah, dude. Think smarter, not harder. Number 44, I am supported. That fell into the upright position. So the one that you are very clueless about is I am compassionate, and that's number nine. So let's read. It's your compassion that makes you shine. You are devoted to helping the greater good and have a strong talent for speaking up for others. Your soul is most satisfied when you are being of service. Aww. I love you guys. This is why I've always said the guys are the heart and the girls are the brain. Because they can outthink shit happening, but guys are, they can outfeel you. So Casanova energy or whatever, just like, uh, uh. and then we have a triple digit. So I, I want you guys to know that too. And you have a master number here. So three, 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 I am powerful. You are being called upon to use your spiritual gifts as a light worker, assisting all of humanity. Live your truths and be a positive light to others. Bro, Aww, look at you. All right. And then this master number, I am supported. Your angels are encouraging you to continue on your present life path with diligence and determination and even greater success will come in the future. You're supported. So no matter what is happening in your life, know that you are compassionate. And that compassion is what is needed in this world, guys. That ability to fight. 
Number 24, I am generous. You have a heart of gold, see? And are very skilled at maintaining balanced, stable relationships. You are loyal to your loved ones and you are able to be nurturer, protector, and provider all at once. Wow. Nurturer, protector, provider. NPP. <laughs> you know me. Who down with me? Now, the one that you don't see that you don't see coming is at the bottom of the deck. What you don't see coming? 777. Check a take. I want you to look at the feminine reading, the divine feminine reading. She got 777. What you don't see coming is your home girl. I'm in the flow. Your purpose flows from within you and everything that is unfolding. You're being uh huh. That is unfolding or being revealed to you is part of your purpose. A state of peace and calmness in your soul. I'm going to reread that because it didn't flow very well. Your purpose flows from within you. Eh? Right, right here. From within you. That's the heart space. And everything that is unfolding or being revealed to you is part of your purpose. A state of peace and calmness is in your soul. So this is what you don't see that's coming because that's homegirl. What up? All right, masculines. I hope this reading helps you. Smash that heart button. Comment, share, subscribe. Say something. Say something to me. If you can, you will achieve. All you got to do is believe. All right, family. As always, take care. Love, light. Love, light, joy, and kind. You got this. Mwah!